I've got a HP NV Touch Smart 15 here that is in because it was running burning hot. And it's been a while since I've done a good old nag about dust. So here is a good old nag about dust. This is what the inside of your laptop might look like. I'm amazed this thing is not dead. I'm astonished it's still alive. Uh, HPs are notorious for cooking themselves. I think the dual heat pipe is the only thing that has saved this one because most laptops only have one of these in them. So uh, let's take this apart and we're gonna clean it up. So we're gonna take the fan out first. Yum, yum, yum. That will all need cleaning out. And then we're also going to drop off the actual heat sinks and we're going to replace the thermal paste on this stuff because it's probably been cooked to hell, which means it won't be doing its job very well. Not completely shot, however, the thermal paste has separated. We've got some sort of very liquid stuff on top of the on top of the chip, and the rest of it's all gone solid, so it won't be doing very good. So that's going into the clean it up pile. Right, let's go and airline these two things down. Okay post air compressor and we've got the worst of it off there we go right now we're going to clean up the old thermal paste get some alcohol on a clock on a bit of kitchen towel All right, that's that clean. Now let's do something about this grotty, grotty cooling system. Look at all that grot. Mmm, ultra grot. Nice. Okay, right, let's put some nice fresh thermal paste on our CPU and GPU. And heatsink goes back on. And the fan can go back in. And while we're here, we'll just make sure that all the hinge screws are nice and tight. Done. And that's how we service a cooling system. Make sure your laptop doesn't look like this one did. <laughs>